Hey, what's going on, Kings and Queens? So I have to come to you guys with a personal video. You guys are going to see um, the video of me and my wife. I have a lot of editing, a lot of pictures of where we went to this fantastic weekend. We were called down to Long Beach, California um, this weekend and to be a part of an international karate um, uh, convention. And it, it's, it's the most, I guess it was the most or the biggest, uh, international convention known since Bruce Lee died. And he used to do it. He was a part of it. And so, um, and so now we were invited down here, which we didn't have no clue about. So, uh, just how God will literally just, just shine his glory on you. When you think nobody's watching you from walking faithful and doing what God commands you, because you know it's God that makes kings, it's God that promotes and demotes, it's the Lord. When you think nobody's watching you, the Lord's watching you. And he's watching you in, behind doors, and outdoors. And he's watching how you live. And when you live faithful and you're pleasing to God, he gives you favor with not only him, but favor with man. And so this person saw us and he invited me and my queen, my wife, uh, Queen uh, Mrs. Curve, North Continent, 2022 in the building. Sorry, my wife told me to slow down. I'm super excited. Okay, Linnea Taylor, my baby girl. Uh, I'm gonna put her on the screen right here so you guys can see her. Um, we both, she, they were, she was called down to make an appearance um, at this international convention. In this convention, we met so many prominent people. We, I met one of my karate heroes. Absolutely amazing. We have movie stars here. We have people um, that were fly flying in from all over the world internationally, guys. When I say internationally, it was international. It was amazing. And they were flying in from all over the place. And we were called in. And so last night was the red carpet event. Right? Last night was the red carpet event. And we took pictures and everything. So we went in. We were doing a monk bang. More than flavor in the building, you guys. Flavor Squad. Like, subscribe to our channel, More Than Flavor, on YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram. You can find us, More Than Flavor. And we were doing a monk bang. Um, I have so much video and so many pictures to, to just put out. But um, we're doing a monk bang and everything. And then as the night goes on, um, they're do, they're giving now the red carpet event last night was actually the um, the uh, Hall of Fame night. So these prominent fighters, these famous fighters, these movie actors and, and fight there are in a, in, in a, uh, the Federation were or the uh, International Karate Convention were being placed in the Hall of Fame. So we're in the hall. So we're watching the Hall of Fame. Absolutely fantastic, amazing. The the energy was nuts. It was bananas. Um, never been to anything like this. So one of the prominent people who was at this uh, convention to get in inducted into the Hall of Fame was no other than Steve Muhammad, the founder of the BKF, the Black Karate Federation, um, um, who used to spar with Bruce Lee. He was he's also uh, known in the movie Enter the Dragon. And so uh, he literally... Uh, uh, was being inducted, absolutely electrifying. This man is blazing fast still. We about 80, close to 80 years old. And this man is fast. I was able to go to, um, the sparring session and, 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 and see, you know, him teach his class and stuff like this. Absolutely ridiculous. Um, I am invited. I'm invited to work out with all the grandmasters. A lot of these or movie stars, um, Grandmaster Steve Muhammad, Enter the Dragon. Um, I'm invited to work out <laughs> looking like this. I didn't know I was going to work out, but this is amazing. This is like, incredibly powerful. This man is, I mean, the floor was shaking. Then when they did whatever move they did, it was like a thunderclap in the air. You could feel the wind and the power behind it. It was absolutely amazing. And Bruce Lee recognized him as one of the fastest uh, um, people he's ever fought or the fastest person, people he's ever sparred with. We, me and my wife took pictures with him. We got a chance to talk to him and we met him more than once. Like we saw him coming in, but we didn't know who he was until we knew who he was. And, you know, we, we, we loved on him and we, you know, we just loved on each other. And so as it goes later into the night, 
they called me and my wife to the wife to the stage. Now we already went over time because it was so lit. The energy was so bananas. We went past the time that we had, the, I guess that they had the convention center rented, you know, the VIP room rented. And so me and my wife are called to the stage and we're called to the side, right? They call me to the side. They're like, so we want to, we want to also recognize Terrell Taylor, uh, for the presidential lifetime achievement award. When I tell you that my heart was out of my chest, my heart was out of my chest. Kings and Queens, your boy was nominated for the uh, 2022 Presidential Lifetime Achievement Award from President Biden himself. It monumental, right? I, I'm like, are you kidding me? I got a pendant and everything. I'm about to show you guys. So let me first read the letter. Let me first read the letter. And, and, and when I say that, when I say that, when you live a life pleasing to God, because remember, the Lord says promotion comes not from the north, east, south, or west, but promotion comes from the Lord. He sets one up in power and he takes one down in power as he wills. And I'm telling you right now, when you are pleasing to the Lord, he gives you favor with man. And who could know about us? Here we, we're in a, we're in a, a crack of the wall somewhere. We're amongst billions of people and God smiles on us and shines his light on us from the leader of leaders of this state. Do you understand? From President Biden himself, we were given recognition. Do you understand what I'm saying, kings and queens? Let me read this letter to you. It's the power of the living God. Serve God, serve Jesus with all of your heart. No matter people hate you, love you, don't like you. It doesn't matter. Honor God and love people. I'm telling you right now, it's amazing. So listen, the White House. First of all, let me just show y'all. Look at the seal though. Look at the seal. Woo oh my God. It's crazy up in here, man. I'm trying to tell you. Let me tell you what it says. Listen. The American story depends not on any one of us, not on some of us, but on all of us. I congratulate you on taking it upon yourself to contribute to the public good. And I'm proud to present you with the President Lifetime Achievement Award in recognition of your service to this great nation. Oh my Jesus. Throughout our country's history, the American story has been strengthened by those who combine an optimism about what can be with the resilience, about what can be with the resilience to that vision into reality. I know I'm not alone in recognizing that those who are willing to step up and volunteer in service of community and country are essential to the ongoing work of forming uh, our more perfect union. By sharing your time and passion, you are helping discover and deliver solutions to challenges we face. Solutions that we need now more than ever. We are living in a moment that calls for hope and light and love. Hope for our futures, light to see our for our, our see our way forward, and love for one another. Come on, does this not sound biblical? Does it not sound like the word of God? God wants us to God. Jesus Christ is the hope of the world, right? And He makes us the light of the world, and He tells us you, they will know you by your love for one another. This is powerful stuff, and we're being recognized for that love. Hallelujah! That faithfulness in season, out of season. Come on, kings and queens. Absolutely amazing. And he says, uh, through your service, you are providing all three. Come on, power of God. On behalf of the American people, I extend my heartfelt appreciation to you for your volunteer le leadership. And I encourage you to continue to answer the call to serve. The country is counting on you. Come on, kings and queens. He said, now this it is. I encourage you to continue to answer the call to serve. Don't you know that Jesus Christ says the greatest among you will be your servant? The greatest among you will be 
your servant. This is absolutely powerful. God is telling you, when you serve, you will be great. I tell people this all the time. I, I went to school to talk to kids. Me and my wife talked to kids this year. I got to put the videos up and everything. But the, the, the quote that I, I lead with is, if you want to be great, serve. If you want to be recognized, serve. God is not mocked. Come on, he's not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he should repent. When he says that this is the way that you be honored, when you humble yourself, he exalts you. And if you exalt yourself, he humble you. This is what he's saying. Serve. You want to be great, serve people. And we are being recognized for that service from the president of the United States himself. You can't script this. It's too good to be scripted. Look at this, kings and queens. Look at this. Absolutely powerful. Here is the Lifetime Achievement Award. Presidential. From Presidential Lifetime Achievement Award from the President of the United States, you guys. Public record. Public record. Yeah, that good paper, too. Oh, yeah. It's that thick, that, that, that money paper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amazing, right? Let me read you guys what it says. With grateful recognition, the AmeriCorps... And the people, I mean, the AmeriCorps and the office of the president of the United States honors Terrell Taylor. Woo! <laughs> Power with the president's lifetime achievement award for their lifelong commitment, building a stronger nation through volunteer service. President Joseph R. Biden Jr. 2022. Come on. Award it, baby. Lifetime Achievement Award, baby. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I'm telling you right now, it's God that promotes. It's God that demotes. Who can snatch me out of God's hand? There's nothing nobody can do to take this from me. I'm serving my God. How I get recognized for worshiping God? How I get recognized for honoring my father? Because my God owns the world. Because my father owns people. He owns conglomerates. He owns nations. He owns everything, controls everything. And when you honor him, he honor you. Come on. God makes kings. God makes queens. I'm telling you right now, it ain't on people. Don't try to please people to get to places. Please God. You want to go higher? Please Jesus. That's who you want to please. You don't worry about trying to please people to get up and get ahead and this, that, and this. No, be authentic. Love God, love people, and God going to exalt you. Look at this. Holla at your boy. And that ain't it, y'all. That ain't it. We've been given in the official, the official pen. I don't know if y'all can see that. Can y'all see this kind of clip? Wait, wait, wait. Let's get in there. Right there. We've been given the, I guess, it, wait, wait. Let's open it up. We've been given the official presidential United States presidential. Hold on. There we go. United States presidential pendant for the lifetime achievement award. Look at that. Y'all absolutely amazing. He pinned this on me yesterday. I'm not done. I want to show y'all something else. This is the power of God right here. So not only did we receive the Lifetime Achievement Award. So he was like, yo, you got your award. Woo -woo. We hugging, we kissing, we laughing, we crying. We're not crying, but we're like screaming. And he goes on. He said, man, let me call you out to the, to the hallway. So he calls us out privately out, you know, because I guess, we, you know, it's time to get out the room. We have, you know, this, they're shutting down, right? So because we went over time. So he pulls us aside, me and my wife, and he says, I have a second award to present to you. He was like, present it to Queen? Like somebody came with the award and was like, present Queen? Queen? You talk about she get a second reward? He get a second award? Wait a minute, hold on. Like he was like, what? Another one? You guys, we have been recognized. This is a certificate of special congressional recognition from the from, from the Congress. From the Congress, Kings and Queens. Whew! In recognition to present to Terrell Taylor, your ac economic contributions to our community. Thank you for your leadership and service. We wish you continued success. From Mike Levin, member of Congress, 49 District, California. Holla at your, look, look, look at the favor. Look at the honor, kings and queens. Look at the favor. Look at it. That's the power.
power of the living God. Public record. This is the power of the living God, kings and queens. And I don't know if you guys see, see my, my picture of me playing over, praying um, over the legislation office. In downtown uh, Olympia, in Washington, I had my hand stretched for, uh, 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 over the legislation building, just praying. I'm going to post that on my Facebook, on my YouTube, on everything. Praying. And, uh, and, and, and like, like I said, the head of the state is Jesus Christ. And here I am being honored and being recognized beyond me, y'all. I, I don't know what to say. Uh, I'm overjoyed. I'm blessed. I, I'm so favored. I feel so much favor. I feel the power of God. I feel the love of God. I feel my father smiling on me and just so pleased with me. We have so many uh, things that was, is, about, is unfolding for us now. We're, we're, about, we're nationwide. We're internationally known right now, y'all. We're internationally known. There's so many people that we've connected to and so many things that we're about to be doing that I couldn't, I couldn't name. I, I, all I can say is love God. All I can say is love Jesus. All I can say is praise his name, glorify him. Glorify the living God. Glorify the King of glory. Exalt him in front, in, in, in behind scenes. Exalt God. Love God. Obey Jesus Christ. He will exalt you. I'm telling you right now. And if you don't know him, give your life to him. Just say, Jesus, I give my life to you. I'm all yours, Lord. I'm all yours. Take my life. Do with it what you will. I'm all yours. Come on. We love you so much. Flavor Squad, we love you, Flavor Squad. Y'all been rocking with us. Y'all been speaking life over us. Y'all been uh, blessing us and sending us blessing and, and decreeing favor. We love you. We love you. We love you. We bless you guys. This award is for y'all too because y'all are the... <clears throat> Y'all are truthful. Y'all are honest. Y'all are diligent. Y'all are, are, are so kind hearted. And like God said, I will bless those that bless you. And I will curse those that curse you. This is for you guys too. We love you so much. We bless you guys. And we praise you, uh, Lord Jesus. Thank you so much. So we'll keep you posted on our trip. We leave tomorrow. Um, uh, in the morning, we should be home uh, later on in the day. And um, and we got some more monk bangs in L.A. rocking for y'all. It's amazing. So we love you. We will see you guys on the next video. All right. Look out for my wife, Linnea Taylor, Miss Nor Miss Curve North Content in 2022. She's dropping this same video in the same spot on her journey and what she feels as amazing. So I love you guys. I will talk to you later. All right. All right. Bye.